Good morning, my friends. Coach Vig, Vogue, but with an I. This is day 12 of your 30 days of morning program. You want to sign up at any time. The link is right down there. Start whenever you wish. Today is a total body stretch. Start your day with some great energy and focus and overall, oh, you can wake up and do this. Do it any time of the day. Today's random question is, what was your favorite, mind you, your favorite TV show as a child, I'm gonna answer you right now. Pinwheel on Nickelodeon in the 80s. Pinwheel, today's special, a close second. Today's special. All right, you ready? Breathe in the nose, out the nose. Let's have an extraordinary day and thanks for starting your day with me. Sean Coach V, Tom Ace. Okay, I like this spot, I'm very excited. I get excited about filming locations. It tends to add to the energy and the focus. Let's press back. Child's pose, stretching the entire body, getting the whole body moving. Always modify as needed and use control. Let's sway back and forth. Take the knees a little more than hip width. Breathe in the nose, out the nose. Arms are loose. Give the fingers and toes some nice wiggles. I'm telling you, these flows, these types of flows, they enhance everything else. Any other kind of training you do, and I recommend doing a lot of cross training to achieve goals, but keep your core strong, your body aligned, your body controlled, and learn how to breathe. Really learn how to breathe into your movement. Circles around. There we are. Everyone's so jealous we're doing this here. Looks interesting, doesn't it? Other direction. Mobility. Move with freedom in your body, in your spine, in your back, from top to bottom. It's a very worthy goal. Okay, bring the right foot forward. Low lunge. Stagger the foot and the knee. And sitting up tall, take the arms back behind you. If you like, if you like, of course, I can't make you do it. Lace the fingers together in the mudra and hinge forward. Drop the head back slightly. Breathe in for five deep breaths. By the way, your stomach should always be pooching when you breathe in. You're breathing down here. You're not up here, not in the shoulders or chest. It's shallow breathing that crushes, absolutely crushes your posture. Shoulders back, breathe, it actually lifts your body up. I trained as an opera singer for many years. I worked as a professional singer and uh, that's how I trained to breathe. It was in your moving about on stage, you're always moving, singing in different positions. You don't wanna compromise that posture. You wanna stay tall, stay focused on lifting from your center. open. It's a beautiful thing. Hinge forward, further, further, forward. All right, let's switch sides. The biggest challenge I have is the sticky mat from all the sweat and sunscreen. <laughs> okay. Here we are, shoulders back and down. And lace the fingers if you like. Focus on that hinge. So we take out the support of the hands here. We're opening the upper body, dropping the shoulders down, even them out as we hinge forward. Rule of thumb, the golden rule in these workouts is forcing your body to adapt, or most workouts. You want to adapt in real time. That's how you grow. That's how you, your body processes and gets stronger. Oh man, I am schwitzing. Mir is heiß. I love seeing people with their doggies. Isn't that lovely? What are they doing? <laughs> All right. Downward facing dog. We're going to add one of my favorites. Down dog dance. Dance, dance, wherever you may be. Okay. We press back. Go forward a little bit. You can hold your down dog, modify as needed, or take this foot back behind. And once we're here, we release the upper body. Huge stretch. Inhale, lift up slightly, exhale, press. 
building some nice function in your shoulders and back also as you lengthen right here think what good this would do if you're a track athlete if you run long distances if you sprint hurdles these beautiful stretches for your back and glutes and legs I want to do this for two hours. I love this one. Let's do two more on each side. Slow it down. Focus in. Dial in that focus. Let it bleed into everything you do throughout the day. Beautiful focus and breath. One more each side. Stretch. We're building off of yesterday's workout. The plank. Get up and plank stretch. Come in and stretch out the whole body. How's that? All right, left foot forward. Whew. Low lunge. Again, stretch that leg back. And let's twist it. Hands together right here and pull to the side. Three breaths. Add a pulse forward with the exhale. So nice now stretch it back we have runner's lunge here or bring it all oh my goodness all the way down keep it loose right here Ooh, side to side shake it out i always visualize rust on the glutes the back wherever flake it off the things that we don't need get rid of it get rid of it right now They don't enhance or bring any sort of joy. Get rid of it. All right, back to that low lunge for just a moment and then switch sides. Oh, the mat is crinkly. It's long, low lunge. Do low lunge every day. So good, building strength in this front leg, core strength, stability, alignment, and also really attacking your hip flexor right back here. Let's add the twist. I assume, I should never assume, because you know what that means. I won't say it, but I assume that since it's day 12, these twists and these stretches, your body is melting into them. Consistency. Discipline, you lack discipline. Consistency, moving all the time, moving. Get outside, get moving. So good for the brain, for the, the mindset, the hope of your day, the hope of your week and month. All right, stretch it back here, hands down or all the way down. I carry, I've talked about this a lot, but I always carry more tension on my right side. I cross train a lot, that evens things out. I bike, I rollerblade, I jog, I do weights, um, but still, it always comes back to this side. I've almost zeroed in on it. It's taken me about 20 years, but old habits die hard, don't they? I know it's a little tension I hold back here in my medius, right in here, piriformis medius, low back area. So this right here, that's releasing it. I find I don't get the tension when I don't think about it. Isn't that weird? The mind lets it go, the body releases. Why do we torture ourselves so? Why? All right, back to down dog. Let's do that dance again. Stretch it out further, further, further. Oh my goodness. See, I'm getting a stretch just adjusting my mat. There we are, back and forth, a little faster. The same attention to the stretch though.
two more times on each side. Then I got a real, oh, I got a good one coming up. You're gonna like this. Variation on pigeon. It's gonna knock your feathers off. Your feathers, get it? Pigeons. I ain't no stool pigeon. Okay, right knee forward. Slide the left leg back. How are we doing in the vicinity here? Save me, save me some of those croissants over there, will you? Okay, we got a pigeon. Now, you're welcome to keep it here with the hands down or the forearms or go to twist and pull. Forearm down, reach back, grab the top of this foot. Uh, twist and pull, so exhale, twist, and then pull that heel towards you. We have not done this one in a while. I can hear a lot of groaning out there. The groans of the joyful, right? The houses of the holy. The groans of the joyful. There's a feeling that I get when I look to the west. And my spirit is trying. Someone's been listening to some Zeppelin lately, haven't they? Two more breaths. How's that feel? You want the hand up here. If it's out here, you're pulling at a disadvantage, you could pull your knee out of alignment. Right here, you're going to pull straight ahead, like a slot machine. But this is all jackpots. You can always tell the mail truck, it has that same cadence, that same rhythm. All right, let's switch to the other side. At any time you wanna dig deeper into any of these movements, pause it, pause the video, practice, practice it, master it. Five deep breaths. This could be the best stretch that you were not doing, but we're doing it now, right? Doing it now, it's never too late. It's just right here, it's right on the mat. We created it out of nothing. Oh, leg back, take them both back, lower down. We have baby cobra rocking side to side on your stomach. <laughs> nice movement in the middle back, shoulder blades. Downward facing dog. What do I got? Oh, I got some doozies. Stretch it out. Bring the feet together. Feet together, ladies and gentlemen. Ah, tuck in the shirt. Twist. Or sway, rather. You could have the twist. Look how my feet go. Look at that. You think down dog. Don't just think of the classic pose. Think of all these variations we do once we've established a strong foundation in the down dog. You have to have that strong foundation. You have to have stability to add on to it, or it's a train wreck. None of the parts work as they should. I'm still pressing into the palms. I'm pressing towards the heels. Makes it more challenging, yes, but that's good. I'm not creeping forward into the upper body. One more time to the side. Oh, okay. Hurdle stretch. Leg forward, other foot into the leg. We're gonna turn, facing this leg. Let's make this active. You can bend the knee as much as you desire. Exhale, hinge forward. Inhale, rise up. Slow and steady. It's not ballistic. You're not shaking into it, pulsing into it. It's a nice slow flow. I was going a little fast there. I apologize. Keeping a lift in the upper body, of course. A lift. I always catch myself, and that's good. Very healthy for me to film these videos. I catch myself while I'm doing it. If I'm kind of slouching in the posture, I'm not doing it as I say I'm doing it. I like that. Correction, correction. All right, 
and one more time let's hold it fingers can be out here on the foot shoulders back and down notice i'm not going like this i just did that but that was to prove a point not going like that right here exhale hinge inhale bend that knee a little bit focus on gently pressing it down to the mat three more breaths Happy, happy hamstrings and calves. Getting out here to film before the big Florida storms roll in. All right, take this hand back, reach it up and back, counteract to that hinging. Guy over there is going, huh, good stretch. Other side. Always balance it out. Are you going to walk in a circle? Here we go. Starting those nice slow hinges forward. Inhale up. Thing I'd like to add when you come up, let those shoulders go back and down. Always adjust so we don't keep going forward and carry that with us on the way up and you turn into Igor. I think a young Frankenstein. Igor. <laughs> I so want to quote the movie, I'm going to resist that right now. Mainly because I couldn't quite remember the line the way it was written. Just remember putting on the Ritz uh, with Frank Barone. In the nose, fill the lungs, shoulders back, exhale through the nose. Those lungs fill and empty them like you're wringing out a wet washcloth. Bring it up, shoulders down, we're tall, rooted in the ground, lifting up through the crown of the head. Now bring it down, find your spot, five breaths. This is it, this is the chance, right here. This is the difference maker. Focus, breathe. So good, we want to stay here for hours, don't we? Come on up, oh, shoulders back and down, and reverse it. It's that nice, mighty lift here. Never discount these reverses, these chest openers, these back bends, side bends. There, you should be doing many, many, many of them throughout the day. Many, it sounds like Larry David. Pretty, pretty, many, many, many throughout the day. Whoa, excuse me. Why, right, my friends, let's shake it out. This is day 12 of your 30 days of morning yoga program. The link to all 30 videos is down below. Click that, share it with someone or many people who need it. You can start it any time. And if this video helped, hit the subscribe button, click that notification bell to get all my workouts. Like, share, always comment. Speaking of commenting, today's random question what was your favorite show as a child? That should no doubt bring back a lot of warm, fuzzy feelings. Eating your cereal, watching the show maybe after school on Saturday mornings. Beautiful, beautiful times. With our son, uh, I kind of arrange it. He watches cartoons, but Saturday mornings I'll go on YouTube, because that's what we have now. And um, you might be watching this from there. Uh, put on classics that I used to watch, like Muppet Babies, Pinwheel, Today's Special or the most absurd and glorious of them all, Pee Wee's Playhouse. My friends, what a gift this is to train together. It's me, Coach V. I'll see you tomorrow for day 13. And as always, until the then, did I say that right? Yeah, all right. Hey, my friend, it's Coach V once again. I wanna give you a special gift to show you how much I appreciate you training with me. It's my most popular 30 minute yoga routine from my exclusive Sean Vig Fitness Training app. All you have to do is click the first link in the comment section below and you'll get that video immediately and I'll add you to my mailing list.